Mediocre tutorials and reviews. That's what we're reacting to today. Delusional woman gets angry when she's told she's ugly. <laughs> All right. For simply being an attractive woman, you could get invited on a yacht by a superstar. Do you think that the same thing is going to happen to a guy for the mere fact that he's just an attractive yeah, male? Are they inviting us to that yacht because they think that we can help the captain drive? boat no they're inviting us to that y'all because they want us to shake our ass so let's let's be serious now i'm not saying that men don't deserve where like their position in society i'm not saying that at all but what i'm saying is when women are granted the opportunity to be in certain spaces it's, be, it's for sexual preferences and that's the bottom line at the end of the day when it comes to like society and careers they're gonna look at paper what's on paper your opportunities presented to you that you can put on a resume when we think about sexuality and all of that we're talking about black women who were sexualized during slavery who were being their slave masters that's what we're talking about we're talking about we're talking that's, about that that's just still important that's just still important no but, you, know but I mean? you gotta think about the what what whoa 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 are you telling me that she's trying to defend women who shake their asses on yachts because they're pretty? She's trying to defend that by saying that black women were sexualized during slavery? Does she even know what the frick she's talking about? I don't think so. I think she has no idea. I think she's someone who loves to talk, has no idea what she's going to say until she's already saying it, and she is very combative. I mean, you could see by how she's using her hands like this... This, this thing that she's doing with her hands is different than when Italians talk with their hands. Italians talk with their hands. They're, they're not doing this, you know, in your space. They're doing this. They're expressive, you know. But this, this is hostile. This is my space. And I'm going to tell you like it is. And that's how it is. And if you don't like it, I don't care. I don't, that's, I just see hostility hostility. This is someone who cannot have a conversation calmly, even if the other person's ideas don't match hers. You see? That's what was presented to us. That's what we had to do to survive, literally, because if not, we would have died. You know what I mean? So it's like, I understand, oh yeah, men and women may not be equal, but at the same, at the same time, don't refute the patriarchy. So there's nobody. Oh my God, buzzwords, buzzwords, buzzwords. Patriarchy, slavery, bullshit, bullshit, bullshit. She got immediately triggered. Holy crap. Tell you one thing, if this woman's looking for a job, don't hire her. Because she will make your life miserable. Don't date women like this. This will make you miserable. Miserable, miserable, miserable. That can get you like that. That head you over came hill. across. In, that in, you in, came across, yeah. Yeah, I ain't that got you head over heels. That have not like blow a bad one. Like just you just naturally just like that person. Like I like Holy them tits. after they give me money. <laughs> <laughs> okay, listen. Let me explain that. Okay, there's some people. Okay, let's say all I see are boobs. First of all. I have a question. Do men find this attractive when, when the boobs hang down? Not when they're like perked up and you can see the cleavage and they're lifted. But do men find it attractive when women wear the shirts where you could see the cleavage, but the cleavage is flat and the, the boobs are saggy? Is that an attractive thing to men? Do they find that attractive? For me, personally, as a lesbian, I find it uh, very unappealing. Very unappealing. Not a, not a, not a fan of the... the the, the saggy boobs and especially if you're gonna put them out there the yeah yeah still could not like just because you give me money don't mean i like you yeah. i can still not like you and just take your money yeah. but the money activates the like if, if it's there no if i don't like you i just don't like you okay i'm okay. gonna take your money still though okay and i'm gonna act like i like you activates me be just but my question is is she a prostitute because if she's she's got to be a prostitute I, I, I don't know who she is but it seems like she's a prostitute she's taking men's Money. Me and my, my friend like. went to Wait, hold up, my bad. I <laughs> copyright. They don't know who the fathers are. Uh okay. Oh. oh yeah. Come on. Come on. It's like they're proud of this shit. Look at them. Oh, oh my god. Tell me you don't have fathers without telling me you don't have fathers. Prime example. Girls, when they grow up, 
They replicate what their mothers do, their parents' personality, actions, the way that they talk. Children parrot the people that they're around. So prime example, how you can tell what kind of uh, mothers they have. Encountered a gym creeper today. Obviously, this guy's not dressed for a good workout. And he just kept wandering from machine to machine, staring at girls while they were working out. And I literally stood next to him for so long, and he didn't even notice me. This is so annoying. We come to work out not to be leered at. And yes, I did record, uh, report him to the front desk and show them the video. What a creep. So let me... I, I, what, what a creep. She's a freaking creep for the one filming the stranger. First of all, the reason why I don't go to a gym, I have a gym set up at home. I don't go to a gym because I can't stand people with their freaking phones. Filming, I can't stand to see the vanity. It would make my head explode. Going to the gym, that's what you see. You see people with their phones. They're filming themselves. They're filming other people, yada, 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 posting a TikTok. I can't freaking stand it. But I also don't have the money to buy the nice gym clothes to go to the gym. So, I mean, I've made fun of for going to the gym while, because I was wearing sunglasses on the treadmill because it was very sunny outside and the sun was reflecting off cars, which was blasting into my eyes. And I was getting made fun of by the front desk is because I was wearing sunglasses on the treadmill. This, these women are a prime example of why I f hate the gym because of this you're making fun of someone why first of all he's not even paying attention to you why are you filming him this is a creep th creepy freaking thing to do second of all maybe he doesn't have the freaking money because he's a hard-working man so he doesn't have the money to buy freaking gym clothes he only has what he has on him at that present time at least he's getting his ass in there and working out and going to the freaking gym and doing something better for himself and then he's got some freaking creep man next to him who's filming him and making fun of him it's absolutely disgusting i'm absolutely freaking appalled Word to the wise, if a woman goes to the gym with her midriff showing, with the booty shorts, she's going there to get attention. Whenever I went to the gym, I was wearing a t-shirt and sweatpants and sneakers because I'm going there to work out. I was going there to work out. Was it going there to get a date or to get looks? I think women dress like this and go to the gym to entrap men, to entrap them so they can film them being quote unquote creepy on film so they can post it on TikTok and get a ton of likes. There, I, there, there's, wow, I just, just men be careful. Just be careful, because women do this. <laughs> First of all, these dudes know that you're filming, right? So if the dudes know that she's filming, they're not going to go anywhere near her because they're f they're probably afraid of entrapment. So I don't freaking blame any dudes for not helping her, especially she's, you see the pants that she's wearing, do you? Because I can see her rectum from here. You think you could help me out over here? Yeah, yeah. Oh, thank you so much. Not surprised. Not surprised at all. Men, watch yourself out there. Women are tricky.